Six Novels in Woodcuts by Lynn Ward. These I've got these are in two two major volumes and they're put out by the Library of America. So it's uh it's comes in a slip cover like this. Which we'll put aside for now. And they come with these dust jackets. But frankly, the books on their own are beautiful, beautifully bound, I think, without the dust jacket. It's Library of America, which anyone who's familiar with it knows that the, the form factor is always the same in that it's always got this thing on the spine. The colors might be different. It's always got the same width and height, but the depth changes depending on how much content is in there. There's a lot of content here. These are uh, six novels. So three in this volume, three in this volume. I've got the dust jacket still on this one. And the novels are, well, let's have a look. They're woodcuts. They're, they're not words. Really no words. And it's kind of interesting and incredible. They both have uh, an introduction by uh, Art Spiegelman, and Art Spiegelman is the editor here. The introduction is the same in both. This reading pictures, it's actually the same text in both volumes. So you're not going to get a different, a different introduction by Art Spiegelman here. Art Spiegelman is, you know, the a godfather of, of, uh, of graphic novels. He wrote Mouse, for example, volumes one and two, Pulitzer Prize winning. The second one was a Pulitzer Prize winner. Okay, so that's what we have here. And um, it's really interesting. Now, unlike some Library of America books, the, the, the pages are actually thick. They're not thin. I suppose, really, there's nothing they can do about the content. They can't really... Um, cram a lot more in there because each page is its own picture. I suppose they could have printed both sides and I'm glad that they didn't. Now if you've never read Lynn Ward, I can tell you from, well, I can't tell you how you're going to react to it, but the way that I reacted to it, It was very challenging for me to enjoy it. <laughs> Let's say that. I um, First of all, it was very, well, let me just think. My very first impression, and I'm, I can't say they're all like this, but it was very uh, dark. And I don't mean, I don't just mean dark, actually, literally, visually dark. It was a dark, a dark story. And it, it wasn't as easy to follow as I thought it would, would be, there, there was interpretation there, like what's actually going on here? What is happening? What's he trying to show me? It wasn't as simple as I had expected. I'd never read any, any Lynn Ward before I got these books. Uh, I got them, well, I got them with, on spec, <laughs> on, you know, speculating that I would really enjoy them and that they would be a piece of of history, of, of graphic history in America. I mean, these were written somewhere from the 30s to the 70s kind of thing. And and that they're, you know, and it's woodblocks. I mean, think of the effort, just think of the effort to write, to put out these novels. Just you have to carve another woodblock for every one of these. And so just from that point alone, it seems valuable and interesting to keep this around you know, to have it on my shelf and to look into it. But I can't say that I really, really enjoyed my Lynn Ward experience. But okay, here we have it. Six volumes in Woodcuts by Lynn Ward. This is a Library of America edition.